Just heard it from the man himself. Temperatures are rising this summer and gas prices are too, and they're expected to go up as we head into the 4th of July weekend. Channel 5's Cassandra Garcia is live at a gas station in Westlaco with more Cassandra. Well, Rudy, Dina, gas prices in our region have gone up more than other areas throughout Texas. We're told it's typical this time of year because the demand for gas is up when travel goes up as well. <laughs> the price of a gallon of unleaded gas is up in the valley. AAA Texas shows prices are up 19 cents from last week in the McAllen Mission Edinburgh area and 32 cents compared to last month's average. In the lower valley, up 15 cents from last week and 26 cents from last month. Drivers are taking notice. And I noticed that it from uh, 287 it jumped or 293 it jumped to three something right now in a couple of days. While it's a normal trend this time of year, AAA says prices in the valley. You're seeing the highest increases on the week. You know, with that said, almost everywhere is seeing increases. You guys are seeing a little bit larger increase than other areas. The gas prices keep going up and I don't see a reason for it. AAA Texas spokesperson Daniel Arm Brewster says it has to do with all the summer travel. Um, if you factor in that a lot of people are going to South Padre Island and, and the coast, uh, you're definitely going to see an increase in demand during this time of year, and that likely is at least one of the contributors. And prices are likely to continue rising as we get closer to one of the biggest holidays of the year, the 4th of July. You could see prices go up, you know, at least another five, 10 cents on average, um, you know, and maybe a little bit higher than that. I would be surprised if they went much higher than that. Basilio Bazan will be one of the many people traveling for the 4th of July. He plans to drive to San Antonio. Unfortunately, I can't take my truck because it's a gas guzzler. So I have to drive in a car, which is more economical. With prices expected to rise even higher in about two weeks, he would avoid spending the extra money on gas if he could. Well, this trip is necessary. I'm helping my, my son move. I probably wouldn't travel you know, at all for vacation. Meanwhile, Valley residents like Victor de la Cruz opted for a weekend that's less popular for travel. We actually just took a trip. It's an impact, but I mean, uh, we have to make the expense anyways. Although gas prices are up right now, they still are a lot lower than what we were paying a year ago by more than a dollar. And according to AAA Texas, gas prices usually don't start trending downward until after the 4th of July, but we're likely to not see a significant decrease, I'm sorry, until after Labor Day. Live in Westlake, Cassandra Garcia, Channel 5 News at 6.